What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. We have a hybrid video for you today. All of these cards are from one of my viewers from Canada, Caleb. So shout out to him. I'll put his Instagram right here. So we're going to check out what he's picking up. We also have an awesome chase from Chase My Cards, which we will do last. So I will move this aside and let's go over this background. So all of these cards were from our last video. On the right, we have our Prism Update or Prism Chronicles Update, Kyrie in the Nets jersey. We've got the KD in the middle, fire card, 20 to 25 bucks. I highly recommend that you guys pick up this card. It is, it's going to be a classic, especially if the Nets do something. If these two guys stay healthy, it's going to be a classic card. Definitely look out for that. Um, 20 bucks should go up. On each side of KD, we have Jimmy Buckets. So Jimmy Butler, purple hollow optic, and a blue velocity optic. So two parallels, 10 bucks each, maybe even cheaper, depending on you know how lucky you get in those auctions. So look out for those. Time to sell those will be when the Heat make the finals and I think they will, so fingers crossed, but when the Heat make the finals, sell the Jimmy Buckets, and probably going into the season with all the hype around KD and Kyrie would be when you sell the Nets cards. So another Jimmy Butler there on the end, it's a mosaic silver, all of them in their first year jerseys with their new team. So none of those are rookies, but they're still great cards with a lot of potential to go up. So with that intro, let's see what Caleb is buying. And I'm gonna get some of these larger ones out of the way just to kind of save space on here. So let's do this one. Seems like it's easy to open. And Caleb sent me all the prices, guys, so I'll put them up there like I always do but I did not memorize them. Ooh, hot start. Boom. Shea Gilgis Alexander, Prism Base. Really nice looking card. I don't have one of these. I'll put what he paid up there. I don't think it's too much yet. So Aiton and Shea are still relatively cheap for how they're playing and you know the steps they've, they've taken going forward. So I think this is a great buy. Anything Shea Gilgis Alexander SGA is a great, great, great buy right now because if Chris Paul gets traded and it's looking likely that he will, then you know this guy is going to take over that team for the most part. If Gallinari gets traded, then all those other OKC rookies that we picked up will do well, like Baisley and Diallo and Dort. I have the Dorts right here, actually, and I noticed that they're different. There are two different parallels. So one has a little blue RC and one has a red one. So if you guys know more about these contenders parallels, then do let me know. So I wanted to put those, bring those out here just to ask you guys about that because I couldn't find too much about them or figure out what's what in there and which one's worth more. So boom. Let's move on to the next one. This is super heavy, so this looks like it is a lot of cards. And looks like there's like cardboard and all kinds of stuff. So I'm just gonna pull this back here to open up. Okay, got these out of there. Several cards. Let's jump right into them. So first off, Sticking with our Nets theme back there, Kyrie Fantasy Stars. Nice, I didn't realize they had Fantasy Stars from this year. Very cool. Cool looking card, horizontal, another horizontal give and go. We have our, we have tons of Lucas like this and the Kyrie does look really nice. The silvers and the green Lucas, or the silver of green, the silver give and go Luca is going way up right now. 
the green is still you know about the same so if you're going after the give and goes even though the greens look nicer the silvers are moving much nicer so um and they look nice these give and goes look really nice so this is a mosaic insert this is an optic insert another mosaic insert so Kyrie got game an optic parallel so this is a pink wave hyper pink i think it's called the hyper pink Kyrie optic nice blue velocity Kyrie. so i have several of these Centering slightly thin on this side. Back looks nice. Beautiful card, beautiful card. I really like this one. Boom, I think this is the, is this the Illusions? Yeah, so this is 1920 Illusions. This is actually the first Illusions I'm seeing in person. I have some Luca, I think they're Luca, yeah, Luca illusions on the way that you'll see in future videos, but very nice. Nice looking shine. Nice looking shine to this one. Love this one though. Love this one. I'm gonna put this one on the top and move on. I'm really excited about this chase too, guys. KD. So this looks like a KD lot. Ooh. I think that's actually a, that might be a throw in because I can see what's on the back here. And I'm just going to take it out very carefully as to not damage Caleb's cards. So let's go over the throw ins first. I'll take these out carefully just in case they're not throw ins. But. KD, Illusions, really nice buy. I'm gonna get some. I'm actually gonna go look for, for this card after I record this video. Kyle Lowry, Give and Go. Kyle Lowry, Green Mosaic Parallel. So I'm just gonna put these back really carefully for Caleb. And I'm sure some of these we will send off to get graded and some of these we will i'll probably just mail them to him if you guys want your international us mail shipped to me and then i consolidate it and send it to you or send it to get graded or whatever you guys want to do let me know hit me up on instagram tons of great information in the description check that out links to supplies in the description as well boom kevin durant Beautiful centering, Chronicles update, Prism base, in the Nets jersey, that same card. Love the centering on this. Love it. Really nice condition. I think this is going to be a grading candidate. And I see a little bit of white on the corner there, but I think it's just the sleeve, so... We won't mess with that, but if it does go in for grading, then make I'll make sure I clean that up for you, Caleb. Love this card. Really, really, really love this card. So let's put that there. Let's put him there. And let's go into this one now. All right, so we've got a whole bunch of sweet, sweet. Look at the way, the, look at these hollows. Oh my gosh, that looks good. Let's go through these. Let's see what we got. Let's go through the ones that are not in the top loader. Colin Sexton, very good stats ending the season. Very, very good stats. Oh yeah, and I messed around with the new lighting. I still have you know this ring light over here that you guys see. I, I will phase it out once I get you know these other lights um, better. But as you can see, you know there's no more of that white stuff on the lights. So hopefully I'm figuring out the lighting stuff. But Dennis Schroeder, love this guy. So these are purple hollows. 
They're actually the same card as this, but because the base has a silver background, um, the hollow ends up looking like this and really nice and it shines a lot more than this Jimmy Butler does. So exactly the same card, but because the base looks like this. So really nice. The Kawhi looks like that. The Durant looks like that. The Kyrie looks like that. You've seen those on this channel. Um, but yeah, and the Markel Fultz looks like that as well. So Sexton, Fultz, Joe Harris, Mikhail Bridges. Love this guy. So no rookies there. So those are vets. Let's put those there. We've got Jay Crowder. We've got Kyrie. Beautiful looking card. Really nice looking card. Next we have Hassan Whiteside. Chris Dunn. Wesley Matthews. Will Barton. If he was playing right now in the playoffs, oh man, the Nuggets, I can't even imagine how good the Nuggets would look. Wendell Carter Jr. So this is a nice lot. I mean, these are really nice looking cards. You know, even if some of them don't go up, like this Pau Gasol, you know, it's still a really nice card to have. So if you're a fan of basketball, then, you know, you appreciate cards like this. I have so many of cards like this that, that I just love and another Kyrie. So tons of cards for Caleb. So this looks like it is two cards, yep. So a hyper pink Kyrie and a purple wave, I believe this is called, a purple wave Kyrie. So you guys got to see a lot of optic parallels in today's video. Thanks to Caleb, courtesy of Caleb. This video is sponsored by Caleb. Go check him out on Instagram. We're gonna move Caleb's cards to the side. And let's get in to this chase. I picked up three of these, $10 each plus $3 shipping. I am chasing six different rookies, Luca, Zion, Ja, Trey, Michael Porter Jr. and Tyler Hero. Chase my cards, check Dan out on Instagram. I will put his Instagram right there, but it's just chase my cards. So check him out, he has some great chases. I'll put all the details of this chase over here somewhere if I haven't already, so that I don't have to memorize it. But I, get, I think it was like three or four colored veterans and one rookie in each of these. So, beautiful packaging. And actually he said there may be some goodie, extra goodies too, so. Still in search of these extra goodies, Dan. So, three, let's go guys. I wanna hit this Luca. I really wanna hit the Luca, but if I hit the MPJ or any of those other guys, including the hero, the hero that I have, the centering is not very good. If I hit the hero, it'll cover this whole lot. So let's see what I got. I'm feeling good about this. I'm feeling good about this today. Oh, and it's all uh, 2018 and 2019. So excellent, excellent packaging. We're starting off with Chris Paul, Thunder card, Houston jersey, red, white, and blue, prism from 2019. Wesley Matthews. Orange Cracked Ice, 2019. Here's our rookie, Grayson Allen. Dan, you are buying way too many Grayson Allens, and I am getting all of them. TJ Leaf, green. So the Chris Paul is cool. Any orange that you get looks nice, in my opinion. But I will move those aside and move on to this one. I consider that a bust. So 0 for 1. 0 for 1, but that's why I bought 3. I hope I don't regret not buying 4. Danny Green. Lakers card in the Toronto jersey. So <laughs> sticking with the theme of vets, colored vets in the wrong jersey, in the wrong card. 
Sabonis, I like this card a lot. I'm happy with this card. Red, white, and blue. Jalen Brunson, I have a bunch of him. I live in Dallas. I actually think this is a really good buy. If you're okay with holding until he gets back from his injury and plays well, then I think this card is a really, really, really great buy for basically nothing. You can get multiple, you know, for under five bucks. Markeith Morris. So red, white, and blue. 0 for 3 still, but I do like Jalen Brunson. And I always get some random obscure rookie from Dan where that I actually end up liking, like Gary Trent Jr. And there's been some other guys, uh, Svi Mihailuk. And, you know, sometimes Dan will message me and be like, I didn't even know that guy was good. And, well, he's not. I just like a lot of players. Dennis Schroeder in the Thunder. This pink card looks nice. Andre Drummond Pistons. And, oh, my gosh, we really got to hit the rookie, guys. This is it. Jerome Robinson. Ooh, and I believe this is a goodie because it's not a base. Oh, and Spicy P, red? This is a nice card. And from the championship year, 1819. This is actually a really nice card. But let's talk about this. You've seen me pick up Jerome Robinsons. I actually did a whole video just on Jerome Robinson, which I know is kind of weird. And it actually wasn't, it didn't end up being that popular. Whoa, there's a weird line right there. I don't know if you guys see that. There's like a weird hollow print line right there. I don't know what that means. If you guys know what that means, let me know. But Jerome Robinson is someone that I really like. He's on the Wizards now, and he played really well in the bubble. And I like him. I like him a lot. And it's a prism parallel that is centered, actually not centered that great, but I guess this counts as one of the other goodies that Dan threw in. So at least it's not, you know, another Omari Spellman or some of those other guys, but definitely, oops, I tend to do that a lot with the good cards, drop them like that. I think I hold them way too light, but I really like this card. I really, really like this card. It looks really nice. So these guys, but I think Caleb's cards were definitely the highlights. You know, these guys are definite, definite buys. I'll put the price of what he paid for that. But, you know, if it's not too much, I really think, you know, you should go after Shea. You know, just make sure you check the centering. If you do plan on getting it graded, check the centering. Definitely check the centering. Please smash that like button for the YouTube algorithm. It really helps the channel out. Drop a comment down below. Subscribe if you haven't. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.